Hi! In this video, we'll demonstrate the steps to code sign and publish your Zoho Creator app for Android devices. Before you get started, make sure to have Java set up in your system as it is needed for generating a key store file. Follow these elemental steps to code sign your app for Android. The command currently displayed on the screen is used for creating a key store file. Navigate to the terminal, paste this command and modify the placeholders for my release key and alias name. Afterwards, press enter and you will be prompted to set and confirm a password. Once you have provided the necessary information, respond to a series of questions and confirm at the end. Finally, hit return to set the same password for the release key. At this point, the key store file has been successfully generated. Navigate to the mobile app section and select create new. Choose the preferred application from the options available. For this demonstration, we'll specify the application type for the user and set the platform as Android. Move on to the next step by entering the package name. Click on Generate Client to acquire a unique identity for the app. This action will redirect you to a new tab. Once there, click on Create to generate an OAuth client ID designed for API integration purposes. For the application icon, let's stay with the default one for the purpose of this demonstration. You have the option to export the mobile app as either an AAB or APK file. This table explains the difference between the AAB and APK file. AAB file. If you wish to publish your app in the Google Play Store, you need an AAB file format. AAB is a publishing format with applications, compiled code and resources. APK file. In contrary, you can just distribute the APK file to your users or customer to install and access the app. Here, Google Play uses AAB files to generate optimized APKs for each device configuration. Here, we'll go with the APK option and upload the key store file generated earlier from the terminal. Proceed to enter the password and the alias name. If you wish to enable the push notification, you have to download Firebase config file and FCM server key from Firebase console and upload it in Creator. Click code sign to start the code signing process. It might take a few minutes to complete. The code signing process is now complete. There are two ways to distribute your app to your users or customers. One, through an invitation link. Two, publish as a native mobile app in the Play Store. To share the code signed app to the invitation link, add the email address and click share. For this demonstration, we have added a user and shared the app's link to their email address. The shared user will be able to see the Zoho Creator branding in the email. The user will have to install the APK file on their Android device. Then, navigate to the APK file in the download section, click install and then click open. Proceed to sign in. Excellent! The user will be able to access the app. You can share this as a rebranded app with your customers in a similar manner using your own domain. If you intend to publish your app on the Google Play Store for it to be accessible as a native mobile app, please visit the link displayed on the screen. We've also included the same link in the description for your convenience. Once you publish the app, it undergoes a review process. The review time may vary from 2 to 7 days based on the Play Store guidelines. Then hurrah! Your app will be available for download as a native mobile app in the Play Store. That's it for this video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to learn more about Zoho Creator and press the bell icon to get notified whenever a new video releases. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.